I'm Megan. I'm Matt. Welcome to our van tour. The abridged version. We already made a van tour, but it's like 25 minutes long. If you want to see the more detailed version, this is the one right here. We've got a 2019 Ram ProMaster 2500. It's the 159 inch wheelbase model, non-extended. It took me six months to build. And I did it all myself. Let me tell you why we chose the ProMaster. It's the widest of the van, so we can sleep this way. We have a push-in bed and all of the seating. We prioritized my ability to be able to work on the road when we decided to make this layout. We have so much counter space and enough space to store all of our stuff. When I built out our van, I wanted to make sure that we had enough storage for all of our stuff. So all of our bigger stuff is on the lower cabinets, and we also have upper cabinets too. These upper cabinets are where all of our soft things go. We also have a headliner. That's just for random crap. We have random crap up here, we have random crap over here, and we have two shelves of random crap over there. So what do we do? Where do we keep our food, and how do we cook? We like to eat. A lot. So we have this basket right here for fresh produce. On the bottom, we have a fridge that's just slightly too small, but it fits about four days worth of groceries. Over here is our pantry where we keep all of the snacks. So let's show you how we cook it all. We cook most of our meals on either this three burner stovetop or the oven. If we don't use either of those, we're using the Instapot, which is powered by our electrical system. <laughs> we have solar, we have 300 amp hour batteries, we have 600 watts of solar, we have inverter chargers, inverters, Bluetooth dongles, we also have a big water tank. <laughs> if you don't know what any of that stuff is that Megan just said, that's okay because we talked about it in our other van tour, but just know we have battery power, solar charging, shore power connecting, and alternator charging. Are you micromanaging my work? I know you needed some help with that one, babe. <laughs> it's okay. Anyways, to the next part. Megan said something about our 40 gallon freshwater tank, and that's correct. We have a 40 gallon freshwater tank, which is connected to a water pump, which is connected to our faucet. We also have a hot water tank, which we hardly ever use, and we carry a six gallon gray water tank, and we empty that by our second door, but I never do it myself, so Matt's gonna show you right now. That's right, we have two sliding doors. It was a real pain to build around, but we're really glad that we have the access to all of our stuff. So we take the gray water out through here, we take our nature's head compost and toilet out through this way. Makes for a really clean maintenance and all that. And when it's really hot, we just open the doors, get a really nice cross breeze. You're probably wondering how we keep the temperature controlled in this van. Well, we have two fans and two windows. On the other side, we have a heater. It's located right under this seat right here that we're not gonna show you because there's a bunch of crap around it. Holy smokes, I am tired. Megan is making the bed. We are about to take a nap. Check this out. It's usually a lot smoother. Come on, baby. Get in. When our bed is out, we have a full-size bed. It's just enough space for us to both sleep peacefully every single night. Thank you for coming to our van tour. If you want to see the full 25-minute van tour, we're going to link it right here. And if you want to see the cost of our van tour, check this out right here and subscribe to our channel over there if you want to see more from us. See you next time.